We've talked about the basics of GoodNote 6, the AI features, and even items you can add to your handwritten notes. But here's the big question. Is it right for you? Because just having cool features isn't enough. The app has to fit into your workflow and actually make your life easier. Let's start with one of GoodNote's biggest strengths, handwriting conversion. It's brilliant. Your notes keep their original in color and size. Converted equations, still editable, and everything becomes searchable once the app indexes them. OCR and GoodNotes gets a perfect score. If handwriting search and conversion matter to you, GoodNotes nails it. The lack of true doc mode is frustrating. It changes the user interface, but your documents remain unchanged. The AI writing tools in GoodNotes aren't the iPadOS ones, though they resemble them. We know this because the ones in GoodNotes use up your monthly AI credits. They're still experimental, and we haven't been able to get them to work. At all. If you've had better luck with these tools, do let us know in the comments. To its credit, GoodNotes supports live text input, Scribble, and it got a handy QuickNote widget. There's also decent data detection for dates, emails, links, you name it. So iPadOS support is good, just missing a few features. GoodNotes absolutely shines when it comes to search. The previews, some of the best you get in a handwriting app. You get enough detail to quickly find what you're looking for. Even with only two filters, notes and outlines, the search tool works. Universal search means you can search through everything. Written notes, type notes, PDFs, outlines, study sets, it's all there. Like many iPad handwriting apps, GoodNotes has its own AI tools. Once your notes are indexed, you can use AI to summarize, quiz yourself, generate mind map diagrams, and even tidy up your handwriting, straighten it out, check out for spellings, and make space when you need it. Remembering the page range you want to work on is always a massive pain though. We hope the developers can improve this. What's not clear is where your data is being stored. If the app is indexing your notes, a copy might be sitting on the developer servers. Ask Good Notes, on the other hand, runs on device, so it creates some gray areas. Editing your pages, GoodNotes covers most of the basics, but manually adding pages at the end of notebooks, that's still a thing. Other apps have automated that, so it's a bit surprising that GoodNotes hasn't. Scrolling options are decent. You can go vertical or horizontal, but a two-page view would really level things up. You can link between pages in the same notebook or across different notebooks. That's a game changer for navigating your notes even if it is only limited to text. We love that now it's easy to go back to the page you came from, but the option is difficult to bring back once it disappears, so maybe it's better if it didn't disappear at all. Would love to lock folders though. Right now, we can only lock individual notebooks, but they remain locked when you close them, and there is no way to manually lock them unless you close and reopen the app. Not ideal, but it's a step in the right direction. But you get solid backup options, multiple formats, and you can even exclude files from syncing, which is brilliant. When it comes to collaboration, GoodNotes is second only to Apple Notes. Yes, it's still link-based and tracking changes could be better, but for a third-party handwriting app, this is as good as it gets. You can collaborate in real time and chat right inside the document. It's a powerful tool for classrooms and small teams to handwrite things down rather than typing them out.
Collaboration alone makes good notes brilliant for classrooms and small teams that want to handwrite their thoughts. In classrooms especially, it makes submitting assignments easier and group projects more practical. If collaboration is a big part of your work, then you definitely want to look into good notes. Still, there's so much to love here. Are you team AI, team handwriting, or both? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and fantastic human, stay fantastic.